Time to up your bar game with celebrity bartender. Is it Prince? Is it Lionel Richie? No, he gets that all the time. It's actually Trevor Burnett. Hey, this is new. You're all about tipicular fixins. What's tipicular? Tipicular is an old bartending term that goes back about uh, 200 years. And, uh, you know, the tipples, the term tipples came, came from tipicular. Okay, so. so let's get into the tipicular, shall we? Uh, first thing we're going to make is a holiday mojito. Mojitos uh -huh. are great. You get the right colors for Christmas because you get some green, you get some red, you get some white in there. So I already put my okay. lime. Uh, segments in there. What we need to do. And by the way, it keeps your breath minty fresh with all of the mint in the mojito. That's a key piece, right? right? You don't want to be stinky at the party. Yeah. So we just get enough of the juice out of the lime. So you muddle it. Correct. You want to give you, it a shot? Go ahead. If you don't have one of these, what do you use? You can use. Uh, you can use the bottom of a bar spoon. Sometimes they have a flat head, or you can use a rolling pin that you might use in the okay. kitchen. All right. Then I like to spank the mint. Here, open your hands, <laughs> Dina, and yes. then just go. You've been a bad mint. Bad, bad mint. <laughs> okay. All right. Then we drop that right in there like this. I always go really heavy with the mint, so you get that yes. nice burst. If you muddle it, you tear it up. It looks gross, and you get a lot of bitter chlorophyll in there. All right. Okay. Next thing we want to add is uh, your your ice. So it's I all about the presentation too. You have the most beautiful. The uh, what do you call them? Bar tools. Yes, bar tools? I do. Lots of bar tools. For Christmas, Grand it's great to get some good bar tools, like a muddler, a bar spoon. We've got super long-handled bar spoon like so. You know what? It's so true. i got to say, I went to one of the stores and I bought this, and people think you know what you're doing at the bar. You they just really put do. it there. You just let it lie, lie there. You, just, you know what you're doing. you got That's the utensils, right? <laughs> okay, cranberries. Fancy. Now, we want to add the uh, Bacardi Oak Heart. Uh, that's a spice rum. So what I'll let you do is why this one? Pour that in there. It's uh, it's got some really great spice, like vanilla notes and uh, cinnamon and that sort of stuff. So it okay. really kind of punches it up. So okay. To speak. So, add so tell bit. me when. Whatever you would usually. Uh, go well, ahead. let's do one of those. Okay, that's about okay. right. Okay. We're gonna drink responsibly. That's good. Which means mocktails for some. Perfect. Add a little bit of soda here, and then I'm gonna add some maple syrup because we want to keep it Canadian seasonal. Yeah. All right. Just like so. Oh, that's beautiful. It looks great, doesn't it? And it's ready, right? Well, it's almost ready. So what I want to do is stir it up, get all the stuff, all the lime segments at the bottom, stir them up like so. Steal it up. Okay. And then uh, top it up with a little more soda. And so the, the most Where did you get part, these cute little straws? Those straws, those straws are also available at BYOB, BYOB Cocktail Emporium. And uh, they go in really nice like that. And of course, you want some mint. And there you go. Some mint Again. Like okay. You are not joking with the mint here. You I put mean, the mint right where the straw is, so when you go down there for a, a little taste. It looks like a salad. Really. I like that you don't skimp. No. That was? Icing sugar. Beautiful. A little bit of snowflake. There's Beautiful snow on that. Christmas cocktail. I put together some punches. Punches are great when you have a big party. All right, this is a gingerbread punch. What I like to do is put some of my Christmas balls in the punch like okay, so. Okay, I need to show this. This is the latest thing at all the hot restaurants and clubs. Correct. They serve ginormous square ice cubes or big like ornamental sized Christmas ball ice cubes. Where do you get this tray? BYOB Cocktail Emporium, or you can get them online. Okay. Try online because BYOB sells out fast. They, they last forever. It takes a long time. It's to terrific. Dissolve. You can actually get a mold like this, or you can get one of these Japanese ice oh. sphere makers, right? And then you can wow. make the actual spheres themselves. And you can put them in your rocks glass. Say, for example, you're drinking scotch or a really terrific um, aged rum like Bacardi Reserva Limitada. It's a uh, terrific to have in your Sorry, arsenal. What else is in there? We've got some gingerbread syrup. All right. So gingerbread is kind of another one of those kind of seasonal things with Christmas. So we have molasses, we have uh, gin, we have sugar, uh, we have some of these really great, you know, spices that I put aside, nutmeg, star anise. Yeah. And so you can come up with these and you basically want to, just like a chef, you want to taste and as you go, kind of develop your own recipes and make it your own, so to speak. Putting you on the spot, what's a mocktail version, if mocktail people would version. like? Okay, a mocktail version, you can get something like falernum. Falernum syrup, which is terrific. This is kind of like a, uh, a spiced syrup that, that you here. get. Uh, and any type of syrup that you make, like you make a tea syrup, you boil the tea with some sugar and some water, you add about an ounce of that, a squeeze of lime, and a little bit of, uh, of a garnish. You know, Feeling you fine. Like. Cheers, my friend. Thank you very much. At Tepicular Fixin' to follow Trev and Facebook.com slash Fixins for more. Remember, do not drink and drive. And here's to a safe holiday season. Salud. Ooh, what's this? Salud. Salud. Oh,